would Dave, have, you know I didn't do anything. Look, if I, if, if I did that to you, I would be arrested. Go ahead, do it to me I right will now. not do it. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by... The, the city, if I understand correctly, has not even accused the Robin Hooders of assaulting anyone. I don't have much on that one, Dave. Move on to another one. You have reached out and assaulted me once. It that's wasn't, what you said, but everybody that's looked at that video my, knows it's not true, and you know that's you not true. You grabbed my arm and pushed Dave, my camera you were right, down. You came right up behind me like this, and I turned and just barely touched you, and you well, got you so upset. But you just did it again. You just I know, touched I'm me again. Sorry. You are not allowed to do that if, I, if the police... I was just representing what would've, happened. Would've, I missed... I didn't do anything, and if you the police know it. Dave, you know I didn't do anything. Look, if I, if, if I did that to you, I would be arrested. Go ahead, do it to me I right will now. not do it. Sorry. Oh, come on. I don't arrest anybody. I don't have that kind of authority. You're being ridiculous. Ridiculous have you state. seen that? You're being you, ridiculous. Touching an officer can get you arrested. I've seen it I'm happen. I'm not an officer. Yeah. And but, either are you. Well, you have worked for the, uh, the city I government. I work for the city government. That's true. Thank you for identifying that. What else can I say to you guys? So would you be willing to, uh, I guess, investigate and maybe put out a some information about who those gentlemen were and no i'm not interested in doing that so we we don't even know if they were federal state nope. or local law nope. enforcement yeah you know, I, I i trust the police department i know that there's a difference of opinion there but i trust them to do a, the right what? thing with the security of an event which can bring 60 to 70 to eighty thousand people downtown Keene. Well, so i'm not opposed I'm to way security home. per se i'm more opposed to the fact that Take care, Bill. I, I guess what was disturbing about the whole thing, like Jim, I said, is they were is, All we can do is answer the same question over and again. So, okay. how's that? How's that? Well, you know, I don't know what to tell you. I you either. You've given us quite a bit of time, and I do appreciate that. All right, Dave. Well. And it was never my intent to do anything other than just turn around and talk to you. Okay. You know, a lot of people have seen well, that old video. Well, I can forgive that kind of thing with no Thank problem. You. But Thank a, you. But a policeman will take me down if I do that to him. Well, One I'm, of your policemen. Well, they probably would take me down if I did that. <laughs> I have that. a feeling they would not. Oh, well, I, I think you're wrong about that. We, none of us have the ability to put our hands on a police officer. We all know that. And I wasn't doing that to you. I was just turning around, Dave, and you know it. You watched that video. No, you, you, you know grabbed it. my arm. So, so you're no, saying that... No, I did not. You're, 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 so you're over embellishing that. So you're saying, like, um, I, I guess there's almost an, an intent aspect of... Like you allegedly, or I guess you did make contact with uh, Mr. Dave here, but so. Uh, no, I, I really didn't intend to do that. That was just, uh, it was ambush journalism, you know, and I just turned around and, you know, that's well, I guess all the, it was. The final thing I, I got, John, um, so I'm kind of, I, you know, I may, maybe you think I'm an unreasonable guy. I'm not sure. I don't want to put words in your mouth. No, but. don't do it then. <laughs> Don't do it. I, I kind of feel insulted. I've, like I've never caught, I've never said anything to you like that, and I've never insulted you either. Well, I, I feel like if the city had grievances about my activities or the activities of the other people named in this lawsuit, uh, it, at least come talk to us before you filed the lawsuit. I've heard you say that before. Okay, and yeah, do you think I've that's a fair it. criticism? Uh, you guys wouldn't appreciate. I don't know that it's a cr fair criticism, but it certainly is something that you know uh, I don't blame you for asking. Whether or not the city needs to come to you directly and have that conversation is another matter. Well, I, I guess the fine, another You didn't come to the corollary. city and have a conversation before you started your Robin Hooding. Mm, that is probably a fair point. Right. So, I but mean, I, no. I did go to the city council and talk about parking. I've issue, always but. enjoyed you, Jim, and I think that you've always come to the council and you always try to have a good sense of humor and talk. You know, in a, in a well, fair-minded manner. <laughs> but like I said, you know, we don't always see each other's opportunities. I'm sure that you've missed some opportunities too along the way.
Egypt people is very nice, and if the Egypt people take my advice, they will strike down the one party state they fear. But that had better not happen here, cause we know that everything would fall apart if the city of Keene, New Hampshire starts to listen to the malcontents at Free Keene and sort of kind of cut spending cause the government needs some expensive things like the wasteful 34 West building and the boondoggle jail where we put hat wearers and other people who could be considered swearers freaking.com